Uh, in order to receive maximum leverage, I'm going to need to have full authority to negotiate on your behalf, and I want 15%. 15%? Uh, uh, I, I thought that lawyers only got 5%. Stay out of this, Phil. This is my daughter. Now, is Amanda going to be involved? Amanda is my partner. You're also a lawyer. My life partner. I love your daughter. But Spacing. Mm -hmm. Rhythm. Rhythm. Yeah. yeah. When, when you sit down to write a screenplay, do you have any particular rituals or, or procedures or, or inspirations that, that get you to the, to the keyboard? Well, my main ritual is just, is just a, a, a sort of overcoming of, of pain. <laughs> yeah. Because I think it's really important to sit down and write whether you want to or not, and that can be, that can be painful um, because you have to confront the fact that you might not feel as if, as if you have anything to say. And the other thing is that my other ritual is that I always – so I always start no matter what. Mm -hmm. I get up and I do it. And uh, I would say to anyone who wants to write, you, you have to do it. Yeah. <laughs> and in film, it's, it's very – everyone else in film can talk about films. It, but the writer actually has to do it. This clip is not going to look like your average uh, documentary footage. Let's, uh, let's watch a clip from Siegfried and Roy. Animals have an emotional language that we can connect with when we are absolutely in the moment with them. This magic connection saved my life and became my life. Like Roy, Siegfried's journey forced him to face his greatest fears. I decided to show my father my first magic trick. Magic had broken this spell. For a moment, I saw within my father the wonder of the child. 